everybody, Cindy out of here with my artsy endeavors. How are we doing today? Um, I'm doing pretty well. What I wanted to share with you guys is this is for my year uh, 2017 of self life and self expression, and I'm doing it uh, based on inspiration, which to me would be um, whatever inspires me, uh, YouTube videos, artists, techniques, that kind of thing. That's what I'm going to be recording in this. Now you've seen this journal before and there are some changes. The first change I made is I took off the big heavy bulky beads on here because they were really starting to drive me bonkers and I figure if they started and I haven't even really began I'm not going to leave them on there for a year so they're gone. Um, in place I put these lighter beads um, I bought these as a string probably in Hobby Lobby. I love to get beads on clearance and they just have such beautiful beads. Um, I threw on some just random strings, uh, yarn um, that I had. This is another just a string of beads. It's on a stretchy thing that I made a while back. And then I have this tassel that's got this little Buddha head on it. Uh, so that I changed and what I did is I put them on this ring so what I can do is when I'm working on the journal, I can just push it up. It's out of the way. All right. So I just want to let you know I had done that. So that is my one change. The other thing I've done is I have a lot of my um, class information, um, prompts, that kind of stuff here in the back. That is where all of my yearly what I'm going to do throughout the year uh, resides okay and then what we're gonna do today is we're gonna work on the prompt the next step forward and that's what this this journal is gonna be for me in 2017 is a step forward in my art uh, whether it be you know with more classes that I take or um, you know who inspires me new techniques that kind of stuff it's all gonna go in here uh, I've just got some ideas here on what I want to put in here. Social media, I want to track my social media numbers and just see what's happening with it. Video ideas, who I want to watch, video tracking, ideas and inspiration. So if I find a video that's got a really cool idea, um, I'm going to put it in here and I'll share it with you all. The classes that I'm taking, um, projects and ideas that I'm working on, like I said, that's all in the back. Um, and I need to, a couple things I need to do is learn more about my video editing program. Uh, I need to learn more about Microsoft Publisher and I need to learn more about Photo Editor. And those are three things that I'm going to actually put as my goals. They're, they're part of my goals for 2017. And then of course I'm going to keep track of new techniques. Now what I want to do, um, since this is going to be a big step forward in 2017, is I want to create this page and I would like to put I don't want to say resolutions because I don't like that word. I want to put my, my goals. What do I want to do in 2017 artistically? So what we're going to do first is I need to get some supplies out. I have absolutely nothing sitting here next to me. And we're going to decorate this page so that I can write on this page. So let me grab some stuff and we'll be right back.
so what I did is I just threw down some paint, did a couple stencils, and then I dried it. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some different pens. I'm going to start out with the white and let's see how this works. And first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to doodle all of these. And I really don't want you guys to have to sit here and watch this whole thing because all I'm going to be doing is exactly that. So, I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> you can't really see it on camera, I don't think. But anyways, I'm going to go white around these. Then I'm going to get it, bring out a black pen. And I'm going to go around the words. And then we're going to start writing down our dreams, our goals, um, and what we want to do for 2017. So, I'm going to go ahead and do this. And I will be right back. All right, so what I did is I did my uh, black around the words, and then I did the white around the actual, um, I don't know what you want to call this, circle here. And now what I want to do, I said check make sure the pen wrote. Um, this is just a Bic extra fine or ultra fine point marker. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put what my goals are for 2017 what do I want to do? What do I want to accomplish? Um, and just go from there. So I'm going to put them around this circle. Um, and I'm just, I'm not doing these in any particular order. Um, but this is my what I'm looking forward to. So my step forward, these are things that I want to accomplish. Um, I'd like to get on another design team. I would love to have, um, you know, uh, breach that 2,000 mark on my uh, YouTube channel. Um, I would like to increase my followers on all my social media. For some reason that's not writing right. I have another one. Let's see if that works. Um, followers, social media. The biggest thing I want to do again in 2017 is learn. I love learning new techniques. Um, I love to learn, uh, you know, another way to draw a face or a different way to um, make it look like a cloud or um, any type of new techniques I like to learn. Um, and this, this I'm sure I'm going to add to throughout the um, 2017, but for now um, I'm just going to put a few in here. I always uh, strive to inspire others. Um, I have a project that I'm, I'm not going to get into at this point that I'm working on, but I'm just going to say I'm going to complete my project. Oh, that's a huge one. And like I said, I'm doing this right now every other one, and these are just things off the top of my head that I'm going to accomplish or want to accomplish in 2017. And like I said, there's sure to be more. Um... thinking I'm thinking hold on just a minute all right so um, I what I have on here right now is I want to I'd like to get on another design team I'd like to increase my YouTube subscribers to over 2,000 um, I would like to increase the followers on my social media talking about the Twitter the Instagram uh, Facebook all of that I definitely need to learn I still like that is my big I love to learn anything um, I still want to inspire others. I want to complete a project that I've started this year. I want to be able to help others through chronic pain and work with chronic pain and how to um, have a life and enjoy life through chronic pain. Um, and another one I have in here is grow as an artist. And I think that's something that we all want to do in 2017. So I just wanted to give you a little heads up on the next step, um, taking the big step forward. And again, you're going to see a lot. Let me bring it back out a little bit. You're going to see a lot more of this journey as 2017 rolls around and we really start getting into our projects and things we're going to do and things we're going to make. And, um, 
it's going to be a it's going to be a fun experience and i really hope you guys will join us you don't have to do yours in inspiration if you just want to keep track of uh, what you're eating throughout the year or you know the weather hey it's a sunny day it's beautiful i got to do this or man it's rainy and crappy and cold and you know anything that you'd like to um, keep track of. We would love to have you join us. Uh, this is myself, Gina Ahrens, Jerry Bellini, and Ann Williamson, and we all have our own Facebook pages that we would love to have you uh, join up with us and follow our progress. And everybody's putting their own spin on it. It's going to be a really cool program. There is no cost for it. Uh, if you want to join us, again, I'm using the composition notebook. You know, it's it's nothing expensive. So we would love to see you. We'd love to see what you're doing and definitely have you share. So as always, be kind, have fun. That's what life's all about. And happy creating. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.